Welcome to this Q&A overview. The Q&A module facilitates communication while automatically creating a full audit trail of correspondence between parties. It's comprised of one answer team and many question teams. A user can only be in one team. Question teams can be deactivated, put on hold, and question limits can be set. Set categories for questions that will be asked. This helps organize questions and route them to designated team members and work groups. In the Workflow section, create custom workflows to distribute questions so certain members only see specific question topics. Users in this custom workflow will only see the questions within the Finance category. Workflows can also be set up for each question team. The Answer Teams dashboard displays an overview for each team and frequently asked questions. The In Progress column has drafted answers, and when answers are given, the question is moved to the Answered column. The dashboard is clickable, and depending on where you click, it will take you to that filtered question list. The question list gives additional details on each question. To open a question, click its row. A window appears and displays all correspondence. When sending a question or answering it, users can link to an existing file or upload a new document if they're allowed to upload. On the right, toggle between available actions and the questions workflow. Questions highlighted in red are questions that have been marked as priority. The answer team can also create frequently asked questions, which all question teams can see. This can help prevent duplicate questions from multiple question teams. The deleted questions section is where any deleted unanswered questions can be restored. And finally, you can import and export all of your correspondence in different formats. That's it for this video. If you have any questions, contact us. We're more than happy to help. Thank you for watching.